Do you have candy canes? Well, then you can make lip scrub. I usually do beauty videos or cooking videos, so I thought it'd be kind of fun to do some beauty in the kitchen. My daughter, Danny, is always going and buying these little lip scrubs that are like eight or nine dollars for this much lip scrub at Lush, and thought it'd be fun to make our own. And interestingly, I got a recipe for lip scrub from Vital Proteins. They make this beef collagen, and I haven't used this yet because you're supposed to cook with it. <laughs> whatever you celebrate. This is Danny. She's going to be in the video and help me make this. Anyway, I was just saying that I've been using this, the marine collagen protein, and I've been just putting it into my tea every day. You can put it into plain water too, but I like it in my fruity tea. And, um, oh good girl, washing my hands. And um, this is the one that you use for the, uh, the lip scrub. And it's a beef gelatin, so it is supposed to nourish our lips and soften them while the crushed candy canes will be totally exfoliating our lips. Now, interesting story. <laughs> I tried to go buy candy canes, and guess what? You can't find peppermint candy canes at Safeway anymore right now. They're all like weird fruity flavors, so I got those. And then Danny was nice enough to go, look, she's doing lip scrub for us. That's a demonstration. You just put it on and... And you can just actually just lick it off, knead it, or rinse it with water. Um, but then she went over to Target and found actual peppermint ones. So we can make two flavors. And it's really easy. All we need to do is use a half scoop of this, two crushed up candy canes, which we will crush up in the food processor, and then two teaspoons, I'm sorry, two tablespoons of water. And so I've got two little custard cups for us to use to do this in. Should we do very cherry, green apple, or orange? Very cherry. Very cherry, okay, and I'm guessing, yeah, those are very cherry. All right, so now probably the hardest thing to do is gonna be unwrapping these. Do you have little containers to put the scrub in? Uh, no, I don't, that's a I'm gonna like this. Point. Well, we could, no. Oh, we should save the old blush ones from now on for our own, ha ha. So the reason that this collagen is supposed it. to be good for you, <laughs> inside and out, according mm -hmm. to my little and again, I I've noticed. Don't put anything in there, tastes like meat now. Okay. I've noticed a difference with my nails for sure. You can't tell right now because after Thanksgiving, I kind of ended up cutting them all back down because the nail polish I had on had kind of stained them really red and I didn't want to buff on the top of them. So, <laughs> what happened? You'll see when you watch it. <laughs> Did a piece go flying? <laughs> um, but I didn't know that you could use it you know, externally, so this should be interesting. But at any rate, I'm sure you could just use normal gelatin to yeah, make this too if you want to. <gasps> <Yeah>! <laughs> oh my god! The dog just totally knocked over the camera. But okay, this is okay. Wait, now I don't even know where the camera. Real life, y'all. Yeah, yeah. Okay. This is wait. How many candy canes do you need? This just two. two. Wait, can the can can they see? Wait, I think the whole thing. I'm funny now. Didn't he be entertaining for a minute? <laughs> there he's, you go. Is the reason. He's the culprit. Like, he's in his little jail suit. She he's put him in his Halloween costume. No, it's because he's a boo-boo. Yeah, he's a boo-boo. She doesn't want him to chew, so she put him in his. Not me. Coat. I don't want I No one wants him to chew. Go on. Okay. Those are in. Now we go food process. Do you want to turn the camera a little bit, Steve? Hold on. Move this over. All right. Mm -hmm. All right. All right. some scrubability. Oh, and if you don't have a food processor, you can just put the candy cane into a Ziploc bag and then like smash it with a spoon or like a little mallet or something. So we're just doing this because it's- We're doing it in this? Um, we're gonna do it, yeah, we'll just do it in there. Smoke. Yeah, so there it is. Smell. It smells so good. Oh, mm -hmm. I nailed it. Yeah, and these are, by the way, the Jelly Belly brand of candy canes. Wait, 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 wait. I'm doing it. And it, but let's use this so that it doesn't let go everywhere. You want to do it? So what we're going to do is take our crushed candy cane. So we will use a half scoop. Oh, this, here we go. So 
It comes with a little not a half scoopy scoop. deal. I know, I'm just showing them the, okay. the, the scooper. It looks like half, right? No. Mm, yeah. It needs less? Oh, that's half. Is that half? Okay. I think. So put that in there. Nice. And then I pre-measured two tablespoons of water. Do you want to dump it in and I'll have a little fork or spoon to spin, <laughs> to spin it with? That. <laughs> to stir it with. Can I do it? It's very liquid. It is very liquid. It's not good. Maybe it has to gel up. Do we have to wait, do we have to wait? In a small bowl, pour two tablespoons of water and then you add the beef gelatin. We did it in the wrong order, but that wouldn't do anything. Okay, more. let's just do more. Oh it's thickening though. Oop. Oh. Oh, okay, when we do the next one, we will uh, we'll follow the directions <laughs> exactly. Okay, so now this is a whole scoop of gelatin. Was, were we, uh, oops. It wasn't supposed to be soupy. It did it's say two tablespoons, to, right? no way. Two tablespoons. Okay. Oh! <laughs> this is going well. Making a mess in the kitchen. Um, okay, but maybe it still works. Is it yeah, I think that we um, crushed and mush. Ooh, it tastes good though. Okay. I feel like those huge chunks are annoying though. Yeah, this would be too big, I think. That yeah. might look more like the picture. Oh yeah, this is totally gelling up. I think we needed to give it a little <laughs> bit of time. Oh well. I like the smell of this one better. Mm. Got it? <laughs> so this is the consistency this time. There are a lot larger chunks in there. Yeah, this is, yeah, and this now has totally thickened put the water yeah. in? I should put the water in, right? Oh, wait, read what it said. So, this is, is it chopped? Crushed candy cane. Can you see that? Can you see that? So this, this one, I think, it I think we chopped it too in finely. In a small bowl, pour two tablespoons of water on top of the candy cane. Okay. So that's done. Okay. Okay. And then, our half scoop. Our half scoop. Oh. <laughs> We're just a disaster. Half scoop. Okay. Now mix or we need to spoons by mine. That looks more scrubby. But it also is not gel to me yet. So. Yeah. So we'll just let it gel for a minute. And in the meantime, I'm gonna try this again. Because now this has really gotten to a nice thick consistency. We crushed our candy too yeah, that really much. Like this might be good like for a face Like I see how something. it would work, but we should have done it thicker, you know? Yeah, because there's not very many chunks in here. So it's really, this is like a microdermabrasion. <gasps> God, the dog again! <laughs> ah! And I think we should try one more and maybe use less water. You know what I mean? To the candy can. Let's see if that, that works. Okay, so I'm going to take some of this now. And put it on my finger. Mm -hmm. That's a paper towel. <laughs> I got it. Here, here, on to you. It tastes good, actually. Mm. Okay. It wasn't super scrubby. I think let's do another one. Although my lips do feel really Maybe soft. Maybe do three candy canes. Do your lips feel soft? My lips actually yeah. feel really soft. Use three mm. candy canes. Okay. Three candy canes. I'm going to do it again now with three candy canes. Green. Green. All right. So we're going to make another one. We're going to make it using green apple. Is that I right? don't know. Let's see. Green apple jelly belly flavored candy cane. Green apple. Green apple. Oh. How thick? Um, did peach just go flying out? Yeah. Oh, because that thing is out. I think grab it. Is this gonna hurt? Here it goes. Yeah. Did it? I don't want it to get too thin. No, but you need thinner than that. If you just crush it with a mallet, it would be more even. Yeah. And we're not going to pound on the granite, we're just going to push. <laughs> that would be mad. Turn, just twist the thing. Uh oh, it's stuck. There we go. Teamwork. Okay. <clears throat> oh, no, no. Ah! You know what? My hands Wait. are clean. Just do it like this. Just use this thing. Use a spoon. What if the dog will eat candy home. canes off the floor? Oh, yeah, I'm smelling or something. Is he a spoon? 
Very smaller bits here. Okay, he shut that. This is not falling there. So, oh. you know what, let's start with like a Jesus. tablespoon of water. Yeah. So do one tablespoon of water. <laughs> well, then add that, add that, and then we'll, we'll go from there, you know? Because you never know. We're being scientists. Okay. Oh, now this looks like the consistency more. I mean, I think now our pieces might be too big. <laughs> but we're getting this now. Mm. Oh my god, it smells so good. How did it possibly become this that much one? Water? Let, here, let's hold up close here. <laughs> let's hold up the fails. So this is the one we chopped up too small. This is the one. I don't know what happened, but I think we also chopped that one too yeah, small. Yeah, and then it's green in it too. So well, and then this is the one that really looks like it's more of the right consistency. All right. Should we try? Wait, wait. Let's get our paper towels ready. That's great. <laughs> can't get any on my finger. My oh, lips burn. I've done this so many times. Okay, I'll do it. See. Ow, my lips. I wonder if we're gonna turn green. Oh, the thingies turn squishy. Mm. <laughs> kind of yummy. Well, my lips feel soft. I don't feel super exfoliated. Yeah, let's go back to that one now. I'm just curious. It's too much. Hey, this one kind of works better now. You know what? Maybe you should just sit for a while. That's a double. Okay, so I think we need to refine our technique here. I think we actually need even less water to the candy canes. We're going to try again, and this time we are going to hand pound these to get the consistency that we want. Okay, what's this? Collagen. Do you put it in it? Mm -hmm. Not yet. Remember, so we're gonna, I'm gonna do a half. <coughs> <laughs> I'm gonna do a half. Should, it, should I do a tablespoon or a half tablespoon? Should I do a half tablespoon? Tablespoon. No, because that was the last time. Okay, so collagen, please. Collagen or the beef stuff? Oh, gelatin, sorry. What's the collagen you can put? Oh, it strengthens your bones and then you put it in your it? hair and your, it makes you feel better. Are you going to put it in it? Put what in it? Oh, no, no. I just showed it because it's the other product I have from them. I got it at Generation Beauty when I was That's over there. That's too little. Yeah, I think you need more than that. No, more water. No, no, no. Really, watch. Because then it'll be like the one that we have from um, Lush. And guess what? If this isn't enough, we can always food process this and get to the texture that we want. See, I think this is going to be more like it. So this is what it looks like here. Much, much more of a scrubby consistency. So you know, you could make a scrub out of this stuff just for your hands or your face or something too. Just using maybe like salt or, or like the raw sugar, the bigger pieces. I'm gonna go ahead and try the scrub. She scrubbed too much, her lips are bugging her now because she did two lush scrubs plus with everything else we've had here. So I'm gonna take this, and here it goes. Mm. Now this feels like a scrub. Uh-oh, it's a mess. No, this one feels like it's working. When you're looking at the cost, you know, this little tiny thing of scrub was nine or ten dollars. We made this whole thing that is at least as much as this, and my scoop of the gelatin was 60 cents, and then we bought this entire box for two dollars and fifty cents, so we used three out of there. So let's just say that two fifty, there's twelve in here, so you know, these are like what 20 cents each. So basically, for less than a dollar, you've got a whole thing of scrub. So, total deal. Okay, so if you're going to do this, I would recommend using three candy canes, less than a tablespoon of water, probably about like a half tablespoon of water, and then your half scoop of the gelatin, whether you're using this beef gelatin. Normal gelatin, though, I don't think it would work because I think you would have to use hot water, which would then melt your sugar. So, I think this would be the easiest one to use. And, yeah, my lips feel soft. and. You know, I'm, I'm gonna like try to scrub my hands with these and see what happens just because we have them and the outside of your hands, outside of your hands make them all soft. Here, let me scrub your hand. With this? Why not? Here. 
<laughs> we'll use this Use one. them all. Just mix them all. <laughs> wait, do I it. think the green one would be best. No, wait, do them all. Although you might end up with green hands. <laughs> <It's> so sticky. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I want to do the jelly one. I'm exfoliating ah! I feel like the jelly one feels like on my skin. Okay, so there's that one. Yeah. Now do the other one if you want. Here. Do the jelliest <laughs> one. This one? This one's yeah. gooey gooey? The gooey one. <laughs> okay. I'm frosting, oh. frosting my daughter. He would love this one. You're like two. To so play in this. I wonder if her hand will be softer. <laughs> Spa treatments in the kitchen. <laughs> Next thing we're putting egg, egg whites all over way. our faces. Oh well. Okay, there we go. All right. Go wash off. Put eggs on your head. You should video it. Oh, that'd be funny. Should we explain that? Yeah. So Danielle has had a zillion surgeries over the last five years, and open heart, kidney, I mean, all kinds of stuff. And every time she has to have a nasty procedure or surgery, I let her crack an egg on the head. So I basically throw on a swimsuit, stand in the shower, you and she has, like crack, <laughs> she has to crack them on the head. Yes, I do have her about five. So, um, well, 12? Because of all that thing, like the pokes. Oh, uh, that's true, that's true. So she's going to crack a dozen eggs on the head at some point. Mm. Maybe we will film it for posterity. Danielle has now washed and dried her hands. They feel softer to you? I don't know what your hands are doing. Like. Like this one feels extra soft. Maybe the gelatin. That was the jellyish one. Let me draw on you. Let's see. Okay. Now your hand. Draw my hand now. Okay. <laughs> Ow! Look at my bone. Okay, that's enough. <laughs> I'm get my shirt. <laughs> I love it. Hand massage. That feels really good. Can you do this like every day for me? Uh, I love hand massages. With the candy cane? Is that weird that this is candy cane? I know, huh? Okay, oh, oh all right. Everywhere. Now we're getting messy. Oh, wow. Ooh, it is soft. Oh, Discovery! It, it's really softer. Okay, so you guys, apparently the gelatin does really soften your skin. And it didn't exfoliate. Do this one. Ooh. This was a jelly hand. This one is softer. Okay guys, apparently that does work. So now we've made a giant mess of the kitchen and we now know how to make lip scrubs. Scrub clean up! And hopefully this helps you if you ever try to make one. So thanks for watching. Feel free to leave comments below if you have any questions or anything and we will try to answer. And uh, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't as we do more wild and wacky things. We. Okay, well hopefully you'll join me. Yeah. Yeah. Scrub just dropped a piece of candy too. Okay. <sighs> okay. Peace out my dudes. Have a great day evening wherever you are. Bye. Bye. Holy Thank shit. you for doing this with me. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> we thought that it'd be fun to make a lip scrub with a dog barking, because that's just how it is. Right? Stop telling me what to do, you're not in the home. But I am. <laughs> Apparently we'll be right back.